Hi and welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking into this video. So today I am going to teach you how to fix the not enough free system memory error on your PS4. So basically this tutorial I am going to teach you how to get more space on your PS4. So the first way that you can do is to select a simple theme. So if you find that your PS4 has sufficient space after you check the storage, then the not enough space might be an error. So to fix this case, you can change the theme to something basic to have a try. So this will free up space while also preserving battery life while a customized theme may appear to be more engaging and have more functionality they have the downside of taking up more storage space next what you can do is to power cycle your ps4 so now another way to fix the wrong space warning is to power cycle your ps4 so power cycling can clear the system cache which might cause storage is insufficiency on PS4. So in addition, it also drains the latent electricity in the hardware components which has an effect on their performance over time. So it is not difficult to power cycle your PS4. You just need to follow these steps. So first one is to turn off your turn off turn it off by pressing and holding the power button until it goes off. And then just unhook the power cable from the socket and wait for around 3 minutes before connecting it back in. And then lastly, you can restart your computer to see if this resolves the issue. And then next, what you can do is to delete the history of the internet browser. So deleting your browser history may assist you in freeing up your space on your PS4. So browser history can accumulate on system storage resulting in a shortage of available storage. So browsing results in the installation of hidden files that eat up free space on your console without your knowledge. So learning those statistics may aid if the resolution of of the problem so these are the steps what that you can do is that first one is to press the options button and then select the browsing history and the next is to select the page in the browsing history you want to open and then lastly to press the options button on the browsing history list screen and then select the clear browsing history so that are the simple steps so remember that you can always pause this video and then follow the steps right here at your own time and then lastly what you can what you can do is to delete old games so if there is not enough storage space you can clean some games and not play them again so to delete you can do these steps to first open your console and then head to your settings and then open system storage management and then go to applications and then after doing that hit the options button to your controller and then select the delete so tick off the games and apps you want to remove and then hit the delete button and that is all for this video and i hope the processes that i showed you fix the problem that you have and I hope you will like this video, subscribe to the channel, and click the notification bell button so you won't miss a video. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.